So here we are, Clerkenwell Design Week. Um, we've reached the final point in this competition. So it's tense, but tonight we'll have the winner announced. The first group, their thinking is that with autonomous vehicles, you don't have crashes anymore, so you don't need the protective bubble of the vehicle anymore, but you can re-engage the thrill of traveling once more. We didn't think we were going to get this far because we took a risk and we've learned a lot and we've really come together as a team. Group three, on the other hand, is looking at how you extend your office space by having a vehicle on call, which is essentially a working space that can configure it any way you want. To be in this far in this competition means absolutely everything. I really enjoy working with these guys. To be here is kind of a, a huge, huge uh, yeah, celebration. <laughs> is trying to find a more engaging way to deal with the interior of the car and a way that is more sociable than we might have expected. Autonomous vehicles doesn't have somebody at the front steering, so all of a sudden you can have a different form of engagement. We just push our imagination, like what we want, what we would like the world to be as well. Well, let's find out who the winner is. The winner of the competition, the three designers who will be going to Paris to work with the design team for a couple of days in July, <laughs> is Aura. Aura had really made the biggest leap in the time frame. So from the, the first judging session where we gave all the teams some feedback, um, they developed theirs in a way that we really weren't expecting. Just amazing, cool, very like, to be honest, I even couldn't believe. I'm just proud of us. Yeah. It'll be fun. Well, it's fun. It's true. I think it's great that major corporations like Renault support students. I think that's fundamental. I've got, I've got a deep understanding of how innovative Renault is as a company now, and so it's been an eye-opener for me. To go out to school to get uh, opinions from our future, our next generation designers, I think this is the, the really uh, important moment for us.